Hey everyone, thank you for joining us today. I'm Tracy Liu, VP of Channel Sales with Clearly IP. Today I'll be giving you an overview of ComExchange, the telecom solution for hospitality. In, our, in the second half of our presentation, we'll have Eduardo Abad joining us for a live demo of the ComExchange interface. Before we begin, I just want to remind everyone that you're muted, but if you have questions, please type them into the Q&A chat and we'll get your questions answered at the end of the presentation. We're also recording this webinar and it will be posted to our website and YouTube channel. So let's get started. So today I'm gonna to be giving you a quick intro of Clearly IP, then jump into ComExchange where we'll discuss features and benefits, PMS integration and deployment options. Then we'll go over hardware and phones for ComExchange as well as some other products to enhance your ComExchange solution. Then we'll enjoy a live demo of the user interface from Eduardo and we'll wrap up with Q&A. So who is Clearly IP? Clearly IP is a VoIP organization that consists of a team of experts with experience building some of the largest telecom applications in the world. We were founded in 2019 in Wisconsin by the innovators behind FreePBX, which is a popular open source platform that people use to build phone systems for businesses. Since then, we've been passionate about building really innovative quality VoIP products. In fact, close to 90% of our staff is engineering. We have corporate offices in Appleton, Wisconsin and Montreal, Canada, as well as a team of global telecom experts located all over the world, including Australia, Colombia, Ecuador, and Argentina. Here is our history. Again, we were founded in 2019, and since then we've grown quite a bit and acquired a number of companies. The one I wanna highlight is 360 Networks, which was founded in 2014. This is where we got the ComExchange platform, where, which we'll be focusing on today. So ComExchange has been around for over 10 years and it's very well established in the hospitality industry. This is the entire Clearly IP product set. Our flagship product is Clearly Cloud, which is a distributed multi-tenant PBX and UCAS platform. We also manufacture our own IP desk phones and gateways to go with our platforms like ComExchange and others. This really gives us an advantage. Clearly IP phones and gateways are built really well and we sell them at great prices exclusively through our resellers, so you won't find them flooded on CDW or Amazon. Clearly IP is a mobile app and soft phone that runs on top of ComExchange, Clearly Cloud, and some other free PBX platforms. Chip trunking is how we got started back in the day. It's a very high quality, reliable chip trunking platform. Cloud Device Manager is our cloud provisioning solution. We support over 300 different models of phones and paging systems. It's highly integrated with Clearly Cloud, but also runs independently. Codex is an emergency alert system for hotels and other places that have an extra security need. With Codex, you can play recorded messages and know which zones are safe for employees and guests. ComExchange is our hospitality suite system, which we'll be focusing on today. Panic button allows you to push a button that's connected to your phone, Nothing changes on the phone, but pages do go out into the world and mic, the mic gets turned on so people can listen in and deliver valuable information during an emergency situation. And SendFax2 is our electronic faxing solution that we'll cover later today. So today we're going to do a deep dive into ComExchange, which is a hospitality specific PBX that's designed to meet the needs of the hotel industry. It's reliable and adaptable, and it's a great solution for hotels that are looking to enhance their guest experience, ensure safety, and streamline operation. Currently, we have everything from small boutique hotels to resort properties with thousands of rooms, all being served on the ComExchange platform. We're in every single one of these hotel chains that you see here, including some of the largest brands across the country. We have over 2,000 hotels serving over 400,000 rooms. The ComExchange platform is able to support dual or triple brand properties on one system for both PMS and call accounting interfaces. ComExchange checks every box from emergency notifications to call accounting. Today, we're gonna to explore some key features that make ComExchange a top choice for integrators. We'll review what's included in our simplified licensing model, then discuss integration with PMS systems and go over the benefits of the different cloud on-premise and hybrid deployment options. We'll also discuss how ComExchange is compliant with 911, emergency notification, and dispatch protocols. And then finally, we'll show you our simple and intuitive management interface that's designed for ease of use. So let's talk about the simplified licensing for ComExchange. 
As you can see here, on the left are over 150 different base phone system features that have been enhanced for hospitality, and they're all included in each user license. It includes features like call queue, wake up calls, and staff and guest voicemails where the guest voicemails are automatically deleted upon checkout. There's also multi-brand support where we can have two or three different hotel brands on the same property and we route calls to different front desks and even talk to different uh, multiple PMS or accounting systems. We've also added features like our hotel dashboard for when the PMS goes down. The only add-on licensing for each user are for call accounting, soft phones, and advanced queue reporting. We'll be going over these enhancements later on in the presentation. ComExchange integrates with the majority of the hotel PMS systems on the market. We can connect with these PMS systems two ways, through an IP address, IP address or serial port. Here's a list of all the PMS providers that we integrate with. We can also integrate with Tiger TMS and Comtrol, which are both hospitality integration companies. They offer hundreds of hospitality applications and integrations with different hotel PMS systems. So any product they can interface with, we should also be able to interface with. And our support team is available to help you with your PMS integration and ensure it's working properly. 911 compliance and emergency protocols are top priorities for hotels these days. Everyone's trying to ensure guest safety and avoid penalties, fees, and lawsuits. ComExchange is compliant with Carrie's law, which requires the ability to dial 911 without dialing 9 first. It's actually a law that was written specifically for hotels, named after Carrie Hunt, who died after her daughter's multiple calls to 911 failed because the motel's phone system required dialing a 9 to reach the outside line. Not only is ComExchange compliant with Carrie's law, we have mass alert settings. So when someone dials 911 or presses a panic button, we can trigger multiple notifications to the front desk, a paging group, or paging system. We can also send texts, emails, and make phone calls until someone answers, so the proper personnel can respond to an emergency situation. ComExchange is also compliant with Ray Bombs Act, which requires that first responders have the necessary information needed to pinpoint the dispatchable location to quickly reach a 911 caller. If you're using Clearly IP SIP trunks, you can program a dispatchable location for each phone right from the ComExchange interface, and there's no need for each phone to have a DID. Another huge benefit is we just added the Codex solution for emergency notifications at no cost, and it's now built right into the ComExchange interface. I'll be talking more about Codex when we dive into enhancements later on. And during the live demo, Eduardo will also show the mass notify alert settings and dispatchable locations within ComExchange. With ComExchange, we've also developed hotel specialized apps that can be added to your IP phone at the front desk, like the Guest Wake Up app and the Guest Management app. While you can manage these features from the management portal, it's also great for the front desk to be able to manage guest room numbers or schedule wake up calls even when the PMS system is down. These hotel apps run on clearly IP phones as well as phones like Yaelink or Song. We have a full text messaging and SMS system integrated with ComExchange. In order to use SMS, you must use clearly IP trunking with an SMS enabled number. You'll have to set up campaigns with a mobile carrier and have a process for allowing customers to opt in and opt out. There are two ways to send and receive text. One through the user control panel, which has a chat room interface, or through the Clearly Anywhere mobile app. Most customers prefer to use Clearly Anywhere. SMS is a great tool for the front desk or concierge to communicate with guests, help them schedule appointments, or communicate when a room is ready. It's also a convenient way for guests to ask for more towels or other room service needs. Guests love this feature, and it really improves guest experience. In the event that the PMS system goes down, ComExchange offers a hotel dashboard that allows you uh, at the front desk to manage guest check-ins and see room availability. Eduardo will be showing you more of this interface during the live demo. Investing in yearly software assurance for your Comic Change system guarantees you'll receive the latest software updates and access to our technical support team for all of your covered systems. These updates introduce new features and enhance usability. So even if you don't plan on using specific new features, staying up to date with your software not only ensures you receive support when you need it most, but also includes critical security and stability improvements. So you get software upgrades, updates, and patches 
as well as protect protection from glitches and bugs. And you have access to our technical support team eight to five Monday through Friday for deployment, migration, and troubleshooting questions. We also have emergency support 24 by seven, 365 days a year. You can also save time and ensure accuracy of your billing with annual updates of the call accounting rate tables. With all of these things, you get peace of mind that your PBX will grow with you and you'll be future-proofing your investment as the hospitality and communication industries evolve. For our resellers, we offer tons of sales, technical, and marketing resources, including detailed documentation and personalized one-on-one -on -one training to help you sell, install, and support ComExchange. We provide pre-sale support like customer consultation calls and tailored product demos to help you close deals more effectively. And we offer post-installation support that gives you access to our technical team who can answer configuration questions and they're available for 24 by seven emergency support. We have an amazing team of quality technicians and account managers that are experts in ComExchange and they're ready to jump in. Now let's talk different deployment options. ComExchange can be deployed on-premise, it can be hosted in the cloud, or you can have a hybrid deployment. I'll take you through the benefits of each option in the next few slides. With an on-premise deployment of ComExchange, a hotel will purchase a one-time user license for each extension and a ComExchange controller that is physically installed and maintained on-site at the hotel. Having the hardware on-site gives customers full control over their communications infrastructure. You can manage software updates and hardware upgrades on your own schedule, and all that data is stored locally, which allows for stringent data protection. Customers can also avoid potential downtime caused by internet outages. On-premise Com Exchange integrates with clearly IP SIP trunks or a SIP provider of your choice for making and receiving calls over the internet. We can also fail over to traditional phone lines and integrate with a T1 PRI. We can also integrate with existing guest room analog phones. This leverages new lower cost IP technology while maintaining compatibility with existing infrastructure. An on-premise deployment is a great to, is a great option for customers that prefer to have a capital expense. You have a higher one-time upfront cost, but the first year of software insurance is included, and you can purchase multiple years without a dis uh, with a discount. With hosted Com Exchange, the PBX is hosted in the cloud and managed entirely by Clearly IP. This eliminates the need for an on-site controller and reduces maintenance responsibilities. While ComExchange was mostly deployed uh, on-prem in the past, there's been a shift to cloud in the last few years. Hotels are now looking for a more modern, flexible solution that scales easily. So with the hosted model, everything including the software insurance is wrapped up into a monthly user subscription. So whether you're adding new users or expanding to new locations, the hosted system can grow without the need to invest in additional hardware. Hosted Com Exchange supports remote management, which ensures seamless guest service even when the staff is off site. It also includes robust security features like encryption and regular audits. Clearly, IP handles updates, maintenance, and support, allowing hotels to focus their, on their core operations without needing in house IT resources. Bundling Clearly, IP SIP trunking or other carriers offer host, offers hotels those lower upfront costs and the hosted model shifts their expenses to operational instead of capital. The hybrid deployment offers best of both worlds. It combines the reliability and control of on-premise with the flexibility and scalability of hosted. In a hybrid deployment, you have your front desk and office IP phones connected to ComExchange hosted in the cloud, while you have a local controller on site for redundancy. That local controller maintains the PMS connectivity and the guest room phone. This ensures continuous operation, even in the, if the internet or a cloud system, the cloud system goes down. And in the, in the event that the internet goes down, guest calls within the hotel can still go through and you can fill over to another SIP provider or traditional phone lines. The hybrid setup provides hotels with on-site dependability and redundancy, while also offering the scalability and flexibility of remote access. That makes it a, ver ver a very versatile and future ready alternative to traditional on-prem or fully hosted solutions. Now let's talk hardware. For the on-prem and hybrid models, Clearly IP manufactures some powerful 1U rack mountable controllers that ComExchange runs on. We have several models that scale up to 3000 extensions 
and they're sized to be as economical as possible. We use best-in-class hardware with quad-core processors, solid-state drives, and gigabit network ports. Each controller comes with a two-year warranty out of the box with an option to increase it to five years. Part of deploying to a hotel involves managing a high volume of phones. A lot of times analog phones are still in the hotel rooms. So to integrate with these legacy phones, we manufacture our own FXS gateways that scale anywhere from two to 96 ports. These gateways allow the analog phones to talk SIP so they can be supported with ComExchange. ComExchange is also carrier agnostic, which allows for multiple carrier options, including a native SIP trunk, a T1 PRI, or an FXO analog line connection with the use of a gateway. Here is Clearly IP's full line of analog and PRI gateways. On the left are our Com Exchange gateways. We have 24, 48, 72, and 96 port modular FXS gateways, as well as smaller eight port gateways. The benefit of our Com Exchange branded gateways is they can be auto provisioned with our provisioning tool directly through the Com Exchange web GUI. On the right, we have 24 and 48 port non modular FXS gateways and a two port. T1 PRI gateway. All of our gateways work seamlessly with ComExchange and come with a two-year warranty. For the front desk and the back office, hotels are installing SIP-based phones. Since ComExchange is a SIP-based phone provider, or SIP-based phone system, we can accommodate all major brands of SIP phones. We have the tightest integration with our own Clearly IP phones, but we also support existing IP phones like Yealink, Polycom, SNOM, and Astra. Here's our own line of Clearly IP desk phones that are tightly integrated with ComExchange. Our desk phones come, all come with dual gigabit ports. They all have color screens, they're sleek, and they look great. They're plug and play with zero touch provisioning, so you don't even have to take the phone out of the box to configure it. We have everything from a basic phone, the 230 on the very right, to our most popular phone for the front desk or general office use, the 250, to a manager phone like the 270, and then all the phones from the 270 and up are Bluetooth and Wi-Fi enabled. Then we have the 280, 290, and 291, which are our Android-powered smartphones for executives and receptionists. The 291, our newest smartphone, comes with a cordless handset and built-in HD camera. If the receptionist wants tactile keys, we also make an expansion set, which integrates with the 270, 280, and 290 phones. And we have accessories like our USB panic button for discrete emergency notifications, a USB camera, an EHS adapter for headsets, and a Wi-Fi Bluetooth dongle for the 230 and 250. Some other features that Clearly IP phones come with are HD voice support, five-way conferencing, and a built-in VPN client. I also want to point out that our phones come with a two-year warranty rather than the standard one-year warranty, and you can extend it to five years. Again, these phones are tightly integrated with ComExchange, and we sell them directly to our partners at great prices with good margins. We even have a phone rental program and branding available, so you can put your logo or the hotel's logo on the front of the phone. Now we're gonna get into some products that will enhance your ComExchange solution. Clearly Anywhere is a mobile app and desktop soft phone. It's great for any manager or employee that needs to be reachable, but it also, but also needs to be able to move about the property and communicate. Their mobile app becomes their mobile desk phone in terms of calling, and they can receive voicemail and dial other users internally, as well as dial externally as if they're calling from the property on site. Versus if you just forward your desk phone to your cell phone, you can't receive voicemails as easily, you can't dial in, um, users internally, or dial externally as if you were on site, or access the SMS chat. With Clearly Anywhere, your extension's everywhere where you need it to be, and it's easily configured using a QR code. It can be installed on a smartphone, a tablet, or a laptop. It has a dial pad and all the standard features and buttons you'd have on a physical desk phone to allow you to transfer, hold, conference, and mute, and more. Also, if you have other employees in your quick dials, you can easily see if they're on a call or not, and you have that chat interface with SMS. You only need to purchase a Clearly Anywhere license for each mobile app user, and it's a wonderful enhancement to ComExchange and your hotel communication system. Another awesome enhancement to ComExchange is CodeX. CodeX is now included at no additional cost and built right into the ComExchange interface. 
It's a solution designed for hotels that need a way to mark areas as safe or unsafe during an emergency and see the real-time status of who has checked in or not checked in. Codex is an ingenious system. Think code red, code yellow, code green. It allows you to pre-record messages that can be sent out over a paging system based on those codes and conditions and send out mass alerts and notifications. On top of that, there's a dashboard of all the rooms and zones within the property or hotel where users can call in and report their status and if they're safe. You can also have camera systems deployed where you can see into each zone like the swimming pool or dining areas so you can see if it's safe even if no one called in. ComXQ Metrics is an advanced call center platform that can be added to ComExchange. It has unlimited queues and campaigns and the ability to track, measure, and report on over 200 different call center metrics like call volume, hold time, reservation booking stats. It also has call monitoring and call recording so you can listen to live and recorded calls for training. And you can manage your reservation center with customizable wall boards and alarms. ComExchange Call Accounting is an add-on use uh, license per extension that gives hotels the ability to track and manage office and guest room telecom expenses. It has a separate GUI uh, that has real-time monitoring, reporting, and integration with ComExchange, where hotel operators can analyze usage patterns, identify cost-saving opportunities, and ensure accurate billing. All of the telecom expenses go directly on the customer folio with long distance and international rates applied automatically. Clearly IP SIP trunks are a great addition to ComExchange. They're a low cost alternative to expensive analog phone lines and T1 PRI connections. Our SIP trunks are resilient, high quality, and fully geo redundant. We support everything you would expect, like local, toll free, international, SMS, and advanced E911 integration. We have both metered and subscription call paths. With metered, you might have hundreds of call paths, but you're only paying for usage by the minute. With subscription call paths, you pay for the number of concurrent call paths, and you get 3,000 pooled minutes for each call path. You can also mix and match metered and call path trunks to save money. For ComExchange, we have integration with our SIP trunks right in the admin interface, which makes it super easy to configure. And we have a self-service portal where you can order SIP trunks, choose the IDs, and be up and running in minutes. For hotels that need to do faxing, we have a virtual fax solution called SendFax2. You can send a fax from virtually anywhere on any device. We can do fax to email, email to fax, fax to analog machine, and fax to print. You can fax from a mobile phone or even a multifunction printer. It's easy to set up and highly reliable. You get reports that tell you when your fax goes through successfully. We, ha we have two types of fax subscriptions, high volume and low volume. And you only need a fax subscription for each concurrent fa call fax path or fax call path. So you don't have to pay for uh, each page per user or per group. For hotels that wanna continue using their physical fax machines, we can still help them eliminate expensive copper lines using our small fax device that can support up to two faxes. Finally, we have our Clearly IP VoIP Failover Gateway, which is a Swiss Army knife of gateways. Two main applications are using it as a failover solution and a POTS line replacement. Hosted PBX is great, but you are reliant on your internet connection. So if you have hosted Com Exchange, the Clearly IP Failover Gateway allows you to maintain calling for your customers in the event of an internet outage. If the internet goes out, it establishes a separate SIP trunk over 4G to provide connectivity. The phones will have a secondary registration to the failover gateway should the first registration fail. So this protects your voice operations during an internet outage and reduces the overall risk with having a cloud solution. Another really useful application for the VoIP failover gateway is a POTS replacement solution. Many hotels are still paying for expensive copper analog lines so they can maintain analog devices such as fire alarms, elevators, and security panels. Hotels can save money by replacing their current analog service with SIP. And if anything happens to the internet, the SIP trunk fails over to 4G to maintain a secure and redundant path. So they can transition from expensive copper phone lines without sacrificing reliability. It's a low cost solution with powerful features that works great with ComExchange. 
Okay, now we've gotten to the live demo portion of our presentation. ComicStrange has a really nice modern intuitive web GUI and I'm gonna turn it over to Eduardo so you can see it in action. Thank you. Hi everyone. So this is the live demo portion of the webinar. We'd like to show you how easy it is to configure everything. And, and first off, just to, to make it clear, Com Exchange is a full, besides the whole the hospitality features, it's a fully featured PBX as well and unified communications. So if you go to the top here, you will see all the modules included and uh, for different sections. And for example, in core configuration, you will see all the different models you will expect from a fully featured PBX, IVR, of course, inbound routes, outbound routes, parking queues, ring groups, extensions themselves. These are the system extension, extensions for the staff personnel of the hotel, but uh, not for the guests. The guest extensions are here rather in this menu, guest management, you see guest extensions. So it's it, so you get everything, time conditions, time groups, just to bear that in mind, uh, but in this webinar, we will focus on the hospitality aspects of the platform. And so basically, first I'm going to go to guest extensions. Here you see all the guest extensions. Um, it is really easy to create new ones. So in this case, we have two batch of extensions from 601 to 650 and from 701 to 750. So if, for example, we need to, those are for room uh, floor six and seven, let's say, if you need to create for room five, for example, or let's say room eight, it will start from extension 801. So you just put in the range, 805, 850, sorry. Uh, room start, you can leave it empty. If you, if the hotel will write one, a different room number uh, and different extension number, you could put the, the first number of the room here. Let's say for some reason they would like 8001 rather than 801, but you will leave it empty and it will be the same value. So you have all the options, ring duration, enable or disable voicemail. If it's disabled, if you and the person is busy, it will just say the, the room number such is busy, please call again. Or you can have a voicemail enabled. If you enable voicemail, every time there's a checkout event, the voicemail messages will, will be deleted and the voicemail mailbox will get emptied for the next guest. Uh, once he checks in, uh, they will have their voicemail box empty uh, uh, and so for, for their operations. And the, this system ha can have two PMS connections, well, multiple PMS. The most regular uh, scenario will be just a PMS connection, one, but you can have multiple, for example, in the same com exchange server, manage, connect, interconnect with multiple hotels for example, in the same building or a same complex, if there could be two or two or more hotels, you could add those interfaces. We'll see that next here in the interface section. And here are optional values for outbound caller ID, and you can increment outbound caller ID by one, so that you do not uh, it can automatically have a caller ID uh, for PST and calls uh, for per room number, and also perhaps a different emergency caller ID per room number. Okay, so that's how we see it's to create extensions, just a few options. If I go back here to guest extensions to show how easy it's to delete, just click here, delete. But uh, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't add extensions, but uh, it's very easy. Just select the range you want to delete and it will delete. So in this example, I can delete all the seven, 700 extensions from 701 to 750. Submit. So for both created, creating and deleting, it's very easy. It's just by ranges, ranges. And here you have no longer the seven seven hundred extension, just the sixth floor, let's say. And here you can see quick information of the status. This is interconnected with the PMS, of course. And you will see check in, check out the status, or do not disturb if any phone is in the do not disturb mode, and the call uh, permissions. If they is checked in, it will automatically switch to the, the permission to unrestricted calls. Uh, but if it's checked out, maybe only allow emergency calls or calls to look, internal calls to, to the front desk, for example. That's, that all can be managed. Um, so let me go next to, for example, quickly show general settings. Here it just shows the, the zip password, the zip secret for um, 
these two settings for registering the, the phones, and, but you can provision them. But it's just a single password. It's a, it's a technical aspect, but basically each phone will register with the same password and different room number, extension number. The, just to quickly show these options, guest speed dials. For example, you can create a code. A code. So normally a, a hotel room will, will not have a um, fancy phone, but maybe just a very, very basic or even an analog phone that will not have perhaps quick dials. So you can press zero for the room service, for example, or nine or zero in this example, or quickly you could add, for example, press, I don't know, for the restaurant. Press six and the destination will be the extension of the restaurant, let's say 3000. So you can have all those options quickly created here for those guest extensions. Interface, this is important part for the interconnecting with the PMS and the call accounting platforms. By default, it comes this first two. This third one was added in the system in case you have more hotels in the same complex, like I mentioned. And if you go here, it's basically the connection parameters and the protocols or emulation to use for the interconnection. So here, many hotels already have come exchange as their PBX in, in, in their PMS, but if not, you can do other options here. Muse, Fias, My Tail Tire, SMDR will be for the call account, interconnection with call account uh, for the CDRs. And here you have many parameters and here in the bottom, you can define if it's an IP connection or if not, it will be a serial connection and you will put the parameters there. You have a lot of options here, but maybe one thing here to note is the class of service. This is where you define once a uh, default check-in status on checkout. The class of service will be the restrictions for the calls. Check-in is, this is the default guest unrestricted. Checkout, for example, guest restricted. And those are managed here in a normal call class of service where you define exactly what type of destinations can be dialed per class of service. And you have other class of service here and permissions. Default is to around room to room calling, but perhaps a hotel would not like that, so not allowed. So and uh, that can be set here as well. Okay. Um, going back here to the menu of guest management, you can go to wake up calls. Here you can manage the options, not set the wake up calls themselves, but the options. So for example, allow a snooze, allow reoccurring. And if you see every time you see this symbol, uh, question mark symbol, it's uh, you get inline help of those uh, of settings here in the web interface. So uh, failure call, what do if the, the guest doesn't answer, um, timers, interval between failure calls, attempt, and here are logs. If you need to check out the logs, you can see the event, the call was set up, call was not answered, wake up call, okay, and here was answered, for example, here was a snooze, and you can see uh, the different call logs or wake up call logs. So those are the settings within the guest management of the common exchange. But we also have, of course, what is the hotel dashboard. This is what um, Tracy showed in a slide. You, so this is in emergency situations where they're like here in the top, the PMS connection is down. You still have the possibility to do check in, check out, set up the do not disturb or disable the do not disturb, set up wake up calls. So even in that rare event that the PMS connection went down, you could still have this basic important functionality and even uh, move rooms, for example, move the guests from one room to another one. If you go here, um, VIP, this is for call accounting for maybe if it's a VIP customer, the call rates will be different like for their calls. You can see the status of their voicemail. You can set a wake up call here as well. So wake up calls can be also set from the phone. If you have the, the staff, the front desk has a clearly IP phone, there's a phone app called wake up and they can use their phone to quickly set up a wake up call from their physical phone sitting on their desk. But they could use, also use this web interface. Mostly they will be using the PMS, but they have these other options as well. Uh, class of service, so you have these few options to manage even if the PMS was down. And you can also get some reports of emergency notifications, wake up calls pending, wake up calls completed, for example. 
spending in this current, no, there will be nothing in this current system or, or any failures. The call was not answered, basically. Uh, so you get all that here in the hotel dashboard. And here in the top, you see another menu called accounting. All accounting is, is already installed in the system, but you do need a licensing license for using it. Here, the first screen you see are the, the latest calls that generated some like a charge, not all calls, but the ones that incurred a charge. And you will see here, but you also have recent calls that will include even the calls that are free or interested in this example that wouldn't generate any charges. So you will have, it's a fully featured call accounting system. You can generate reports on demand uh, and all any of these reports, or even you can uh, deliver reports via email um, at any moment. And you can test a call, for example, you can put the, how to, to be sure if your call rates are, are okay. So for the call rates, you can import a file and via an H file, or you can manually set the call rates but um and after that after you uh, uh, added the call rates for each uh, destination time of day day of week uh, be as specific as needed for the call rates then you can test let's say okay now that the information is uploaded let me test from my room uh, this current date current time some dial digits and the duration of the call let's say it's five minutes and then, like here, I would need to put a number. Okay. In any case, it will show here. Um, because this room was CXO2, this is a VIP, but if I change here like 600 or let's say 605, it wouldn't be a VIP, it's a default guest. And you can have, diff you can test your, how, how it will go. And so that, so basically that's it with a call accounting. You, you, in here, in the admin section, you, you, so let me go back here to Com Exchange for a little while and go here. Another way to go to the call accounting is here in reports and click here, call accounting. And this is the admin section. Here you can see the status of the connections with the PBX, which is actually in the same system, but it's an interconnection nonetheless between the call accounting and the PBX and the interconnection with the PMS, what's the status. And here you can configure the parameters for the connection. And um, well, here are the different, um, uh, here in the call pricing is where I mentioned that you can manually enter the, the rates, but you can also import a VNH file for having the rates. And the report, like, uh, no, this is scheduler. You can put the emails here and reports. You have posted calls, the calls that have been sent to the PMS and posted calls that have not yet been sent to the PMS. And you can have incoming calls. Well, you can have different type of reports or create a new new reports from scratch on based on a, a, a current report that exists already in the system. So you have all those options here in call accounting. Um, basically, and here in VIP guest, you can define which room will be a VIP customer for different call rates, like I mentioned. So let me go back to Com Exchange for now. And we check already the call accounting and the hotel dashboard. I wanted to show you as well the Codex integration we have here in the top. Codex is already included for free in the latest versions of Com Exchange. So you can be, uh, you can have ma two type of uh, approaches, just must notify of an emergency situation or ask for a checking or like a status of each room or each each place that you want to monitor. So if you add a code here, just put a number description and here's the mode checking or just must notify. If it's checking, some more options are here for extension to require checking, as you see. Here it will list all the staff extensions, not the guest rooms, but here below you can put yes to require a Every room that has a, a guest, like it's in checking a status, will, will receive a call uh, demanding press one if you're safe, press nine if you are not safe. So in uh, natural disaster events or any other uh, emergency situation, you can require for different rooms or maybe not the, not the guest rooms, but the staff rooms 
uh, you can be as precise as, as you need to define what uh, rooms or phones will get ringed or paged. Page for, for hotel rooms is not available. Mostly they, they will be analog phones, but paging for staff personnel, you can select here. Let's say I want this for paging and these other ones for calling, just regular calls, let's say. And you can select which one will require a checking that I'm safe or not safe. Uh, so you have, have you have all those options and even deliver a report via email. And this is a nice moment to, for example, show this also in the user control panel. If I go back here in, at the top, we have already run some campaigns in Codex. Um, so if I go here, a report for, for past uh, campaigns, you can see in this case, you can see the report is two extensions of a ring and both were answered or perhaps this latest one unknown because the person didn't answer. But this was just a notification. This was not a, a campaign for checking in the status of safe or unsafe. If I go, that's the, the, on the top, you see this uh, tab for events. If you go to earthquake events, for example, in this other example, this campaign was for checking or check out the status. So if you go here, you see that this person marked a safe in the phone call that they received, they press one. These two persons did the same in this other event. And in this other case, one wasn't safe, one safe. So you, and you can start a campaign by dialing its number 44 in this example. And the code safe will be this. If you, in the first call, you didn't press one or nine for safe or unsafe, you can still use this, this, this uh, string of codes with feature code to mark yourself self as safe or unsafe. And you can start the campaign from here or by dialing just the number 44 in this example. Um, and uh, at that moment in, in any emergency situation. And uh, another thing in the user control panel that all, all the staff people can get access to is this, uh, another tab, this provisioning of the clearly IP, clearly anywhere, soft phone for uh, Apple and an Android. You can download quickly with the QR code. You will register the extension. You do not need to enter any credentials. It's very easy using the QR code. And then you can have SMS here in the right. You see some reports. If you have different conversations, you will see them here. But here with just one single number, you can see here in the top bottom left, bottom right, sorry, um, an example of uh, how to use this. You will be sending SMS messages with your guests. And you can replay from here or from your mobile app, the Clearly Anywhere mobile app. Those are two places where you can uh, do SMS texting with, with the guests. Um, so okay, going out of here, one last thing maybe to show at this moment is the failover. We already have a failover possibility where you can have two systems. They could be both on-prem or maybe one system in the cloud hosted by us and another system in prem and they can um, sync together the primary will sync with the secondary server in the event of the primary going down or the communication of, to the primary being unavailable the the operation can still resume keep going using the secondary server uh, it's very easy to configure you just just set a, each system as primary or secondary put the, IP, the local IP and the remote IP of the other system and use this secret. Do this in both systems and they will start syncing from the primary to the secondary, uh, except some options like networking parameters or failover trunks that maybe are different in the secondary system than in the primary system, but the rest of, of information will get synced together and you have that uh, failover option. It, it's and At that moment, it's, it's easy to manage. You just manage your primary server and you do not ever need to, to manage the secondary server because everything will be done from the primary for managing at that moment. Um, and those, those, that was mostly it that we wanted to show with the some exchange guests, rules, functionalities, and codex integration and this failover as well. And the, the hotel dashboard that, that we saw and the call accounting. Are there any questions, Tracy? In the, uh, not regarding your mm -hmm. live portion. Mm -hmm. Okay, is that it? Yes.
Awesome. Okay. So uh, I'm going to take the screen by back really quick. Mm -hmm. Um, this does conclude our presentation on Com Exchange today, but before I jump over to q and I just wanted to tell everyone about our next event, How to Integrate Spoke by Clearly IP with your CRM and workflow tools. This will take place on November 7th, and you can go to clearlyip.com slash events to register or see all of our upcoming webinars and events that we will be attending. Speaking of events, we are going to be at the Hospitality Show hosted by AHLA in San Antonio, Texas on October 28th through 30th. So if you're attending, please reach out and schedule a meeting with us or come by our booth, uh, 1858. Thank you so much for taking the time out of your busy day to learn about ComExchange, the hospitality solution. Let's see if we have any questions. So it looks like we have quite a few. As partners, do we need any special certification or training to resell ComExchange? So there's no special certification, but we do provide technical training, and we do have one exclusion from that. With some hotel brands, we as the manufacturer have agreements that we have to certify and indemnify the installation as part of the platform certification for those particular chains. So each system integrator and installer does need to be approved by us in advance and enter into an additional agreement for providing services to those brands. When you sync with a PMS, does the room extension sync with the guest info? Yes, it does. Do, does ComExchange offer in its solution portfolio analog FXS gateways in the case that the hotel's transitioning from an IP PBX from legacy systems? Yes, we, we have a full line of FXS analog gateways for ComExchange. Is there an API to the ComExchange PMS integration in the case that the PMS is not a well-known one or an in-house one? Um, so we developed the platform ourselves and we could potentially develop an integration directly if needed, assuming the financials make sense for us to do so. So we support Muse API, BIOS, as well as Mitel emulation, which many smaller PMS platforms will support. Uh, do you have a housekeeping module for clean or dirty room? Yes, we can send the clean or dirty room status to the PMS. And does Clearly IP offer consulting services on projects for partners with resellers that are getting into the hospitality industry for the first time? So yeah, I mean, we, we usually will do the training and we'll help you with the initial setup um, at no cost for the first one. Uh, for If it's an end customer, though, however, we do charge for that. Um, it looks like that was the last question. Do we have any more questions? Oh, what should we do to go forward and start offering this type of solution? Good question. So if you go to our website, clearlyip.com, and you hover over Partners at the top and click on Partner Program, we have a link where you can just fill out a quick form and somebody will reach out to you and schedule a meeting and we'll go over our partner program for Com Exchange and how you can sell it. All right, well, thank you everyone so much for your time today. That wraps up and concludes our Com Exchange presentation.